training with the K-9 unit. That's Students the in the law enforcement program at May River High School learned how the Bluffton Police Department uses police dogs. So the K-9 is used for countless things, investigating narcotics crimes, uh, investigating any sort of serious crime or missing person. So the K-9 is used really for multi purpose and also diffusing situations, getting violent criminals to surrender without having to use any sort of force. So just basically showing them that the dog is used for countless things. <laughs> Students had the chance to see how the dog tracks down a suspect with the help of their teacher. I just stuck my arm out and he, he grabbed on it and you can really feel it in your shoulder and in your back. Um, he's, he's a powerful, powerful dog. Students say it's impressive to see the dog in action. Well, the one thing I did think is how persistent they are. They will keep attacking until they finally are told the command to stop. The officer also demonstrated some obedience and training exercises inside the classroom and showed the students how the dog smells our narcotics. You could hear the breathing change and you could see how hectic he got when something was around and when he, when he found it. He made no noise. He just sat down and stared at exactly where the drug was located. I thought that was, that was crazy. The officer also talked about the process of training his four-legged partner. He told me that they train each dog five, at least 500 hours, which, I mean, you think about 500 hours, that's a lot of hours. And for him to learn the control of the commands that he showed us, um, he said it took him two weeks for him to learn the German words for control, and I just thought it was very impressive. The most interesting thing that I learned was that if the dog, for some reason, can't smell as well or just can't get the bite right, that they can't use him anymore, and um, this dog can do everything. I mean, he has all these commands in different languages, which probably was the most interesting thing to me was the languages that they use to command these dogs. More than 100 students are enrolled in the law enforcement program. At May River High School, Ron Lopes, Buford County School District.